signal went back to what the machine could do. People who are on the verge of being foreclosed, foreclosed on will generally do anything they can possibly do to save their home. So when someone knocks on your door and says, I got a great deal for you, you got to be very careful because nothing's free. So these will set rules to make, uh, to make that kind of industry and that kind of business uh, be more adhering to consumer protection uh, situations that have to occur. We talk about wanting to become a greener state and this bill I think is one of the most significant ones we've done because it requires developers to inform people when they're in the process of building a house that they can have solar energy installed. Well we believe that you know by having individuals licensed instead of just registered uh, with continuing education courses and certifications that would be part of getting your license in the state of New Jersey that those lenders that are going out are not the fly-by-night lenders out there, that they're quality lenders, uh, that the programs that they're offering the residents of the state of New Jersey for the finance of their housing or any other loans, you know, are, are the best that we can possibly have to protect our residents in the state of New Jersey. This would create a tax amnesty period that would allow up for an additional 45 days expiring on June 15th for those who have missed a tax payment or, or delinquent in their taxes to do so without incurring additional penalties, fees, criminal charges. It's something that we hope people will take advantage of. We've done this in some previous years. This is obviously the worst uh, economic crisis we've faced and the state anticipates it would generate somewhere around $100 million. And the idea is to defer a little, just like every homeowner is now trying to make ends meet, pay it back over a longer period of time. So let's do it smart for homeowners, smart for communities, smart for the taxpayers in New Jersey. Thank <laughs> you.